Well, hello there. My name's Tyler, and you're watching I Suck at Drafting, which is my new video series about the fact that I suck at drafting. I'm trying really hard to get better. I'm trying to learn the cards, learn the whole drafting strategy. I listen to podcasts, I read articles, and I just can't seem to get any better at all. So here's me throwing myself to the wolves, making a video, showing you guys my drafting, and then uh, trying to survive uh, the answers I get back. So uh, I've never played with Diagraph Colossus. Uh, and I've never drafted a zombie deck in limited, so I guess we can take a look. I can give it a go. I could at least take it. I mean, what's the chances we play this fucking thing anyway? So, uh, it's one one counter for each zombie card in your graveyard, and when you cast a zombie spell, you can put. You know, it seems awesome. Uh, I've recently made a cube, which uh, I did throw this guy in there. I did put zombies in my cube so okay let's go through this really quick there's a dead weight if we wanted to stay black that's always a good way to go spiteful motives is fun but I've had little to no luck uh, with red in this set so I'm a little adverse it's probably a reason I have all these beliefs uh, about uh, about cards so uh, let's take a look here I love Abyssinian missionaries I live 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 it uh, but it's always a gamble whether you're going to get any good equipment. Uh, so I think, and correct me if I'm wrong in the comments, I expect to get lots of comments if people watch this. I think that dead weight is the way I want to go here. Uh, it's on color. I think it's the best card. Uh, and it's removal. So that's my thinking. Uh, I love the missionaries. It's such good. So, so good. You know, we're, we're going for it. Well, the one thing I found that I have a problem with um, in this set and drafting, I have problems with it online more than anything, which is silly, uh, is that I never end up drafting enough creatures. I'm always creature light. Uh, and I've gotten pounded pretty hard for not having enough creatures. So, embarrassing. I think Sinister Concoction is what we want. Uh, once again, it's removal. It's enchantment. I love drafting black green delirium decks. That's like where it's at. Uh, Rabid bites also good, but we're not in green yet. You can see that there's some blue cards here that are pretty good. Uh, so we'll keep an eye out for that. But you know, let's see. Let's uh, let's keep the black coming. <sighs> we might be sending mixed signals though, letting a dead weight go to our partner. Uh, next to us, but let's find out. Let's find out. I hate waiting. That's probably another problem. Just impatient, impatient magic player. Toppelgeist. Sanitarium skeleton. He's a bro. Uh, I get excited for the Toppelgeist. I think he is awesome. Uh, Sanitarium Skeleton does a lot of work as well, uh, especially when you discard a lot of things. He's kind of a, a nice little tool. Uh, but we're going to go Toppelgeist here. I don't really see anything else that appeals to me. Uh, I'm not really seeing any signs of what might be open. I mean, we got past the missionary, but that was second pick. Toppelgeist, I don't know how highly people pick him. I might be one of those one of those chums. I guess I, if I wanted to consider going blue, because it looks like blue might be open, I should just start diving balls deep into those zombies. A Dauntless Cathar. Well. Well. There's a screw. Ooh, Tooth Collector. Shit. I gotta go tooth collector. I mean, I'm already I'm dipping my toes into that black pretty hard, so 
I'm feeling this tooth collector. Uh, and I guess maybe some black white delirium is in order. So, which means we might need some green. Ooh, harvest hands is also very good for our missionary, but not good enough that we're gonna overlook a tooth collector for it. Rise from the top, uh, neglected heirloom. We did it, people. We did it. We did it. Blues. I think blues definitely open, but. I'm so happy with black white right now, uh, and I'm so happy to take a neglected heirloom for my Avicen, uh, Avicenian missionaries. So, ooh, that's nice. Mmm. Second harvest, the most past rare I think in the set, which is ridiculous. Uh, it's probably not a great card. Oh, look at all this red. Uh, but. I don't think it's a bad card. So wait, we're doing good. I think so far I'm feeling pretty good about this. We got lots of creatures. I uh, don't, I guess if we're going to go Delirium, Stallion of Ashmouth, kind of meh, but it's something. It's in our colors. It's something. We've cut black. Ooh, Power Hound. St Stitch Mangler. See, this is tough because, you know, it might come about that blue is wide open. I mean, it looks. Oh, Wicker Witch. It looks like. I don't know. I'm talking out my ass here, people. I don't know. But a macabre waltz makes me happy. Or we uh, we shelter ourselves for the inevitable green splash we're going to want if we're going full delirium. There's delirium cards, there's zombie cards, there's so much in this pack. We're, we're guess we're going with that. See what happened. Oh, look, and we didn't even pay for it. Um, I like the truth face sensor and expose evil here. Uh, Macabre Waltz is great, but it, it's not really, it's not going to help us. It's not going to help us put things on the board uh, or buff our things on the board. or It's not going to do what we want it to do, I think. Uh, it might be nice to get one, but they're common. Uh, I think another artifact is what we want, just in case. And truth face sensor, you can't really go wrong. Hmm. Okay, well, I mean, we can commit to the white. Uh, it looks like, I mean, Cathar's Companion's done nothing but good for me, uh, especially if you're playing some tricks or if you're playing some tempo plays. I feel like he goes better in the white-blue version of this. Look at this name. That's crap here. Delirium again. Uh, Hand of, what is it, H H Farbogs? Hound of the Farbogs. Uh, this homie, I've been worked over by him before, but I don't think that means he's good. Uh, I think uh, what that means is just I'm a poor player. Uh, which one of these crappy cards do I want to take? Oh, look at this. I think blue's open, guys. I think blue's open. If we see some good blue, we might cut into it. We might go blue. Because uh, you know what? I'm not... I'm not wholly convinced that white is open I'm actually kind of not but we've got you know we've got good black playables and this Abyssinian missionaries we could splash white pretty good oh look at that oh look at this well holy crap uh, that's it's a great white card uh, Especially if we can get some more Cathars or a Near Heath Chaplain. We can get crazy with spirits. But I've always wanted to make the deck where you mill yourself. And you get that epitaph goal I'm going. Just the, unfortunately, I do have, I have a good bit of delirium things. Oh, look, there's a throttle too. Uh, I just don't have the other makeup. I don't have any vampires sitting around. I think we just go with the drag skull cavalry and see how it goes and hope maybe this wheels it's possible it will uh fuck because we we are going white and this thing does you know i've gotten it in limited before and it does some work so let's see what let's see what we could do Ooh, tunnel bloom throttle apothecary Geist. Our Wicker Witch. I think we're gonna. 
you know, I really do love the green enchantments in this uh, set, and this is definitely one of them. And I kind of want to take it on the off chance that we try to go full delirium. The throttle's kind of nice because it's more removal, but I mean, if we we got we're doing all right on removal so far, so we'll see what we can get. But I'm gonna take this for now. I'm gonna take the plant. Oh, I think that's it right there. That's what we want. Black is our friend. We definitely did it with black. I think we're good. Black is powerful. Uh, this is gonna help help us with our deliriums. I don't really see another option here. I don't see a good option. Murder's axe is great, but you know what? Nobody takes those things. So uh, if we want it, I mean, we're not going too hard into the. Huh. Huh, huh, huh. So let's see. <sighs> That's not an option because the graph mole is not an option because we do not. We are not generating any clues at all here. Zera. We got Zera. More removal in white. Yay us. Uh, I think our Diagraph Colossus is pretty much lost us here. Unless we could, or we could take the Rancid Rats. That goes towards it. Zombie Hound goes towards it. I mean, the dream's not dead, but I don't think we're going blue. I like blue, but I don't think we're going blue. So let's go with it. Let's get some removal going. Mmm, Triskaidekaphobia. Uh, I learned my lesson watching Channel Fireball yesterday not to take that card. Uh, I don't have any comments beyond that. <coughs> so, Throttle, the Necropod. Necropod's a good finisher. And we are blackity black, so... Throttle. What's our removal looking like here? <laughs> All right, let's go with the Necropod. So once again, we don't want to end up at the... Oh, two brain in a jar is going around the table. Let's watch them go around the drain. Uh, Merciless Resolve. Apothecary Geist. I mean, we have... All of three spirit. Or we have two in our pool right now, but we have we we would have three, and it's a two three flyer for four. Are we mad at that, people? I don't know. I don't know if that does it for me. I don't know, but it could mean life gain if we go along the lines of white black spirits. We get a far bog. Uh, what the heck is it called? The one three skulker with life link vessel of nascency. I like seeing that really late. And I'm definitely thinking of taking it. Otherwise, it's the twins, uh, which we could madness out if we have our sinister concoction. Does that let? It, do we choose a card to discard? Yeah. So sinister concoction can get a twins out for us for three, four mana. Uh, but I'm keeping the dream alive, guys. I'm keeping it alive. I think red was pretty open, but I didn't see red creatures, so maybe not. Hmm. I'm not liking this at all. There's nothing here for me. I could take the provisioner if I'm thinking I'm definitely gonna. No, see, it's not even for me. Doesn't make me happy. Crappy land, crappy, crappy land. Don't play it, is what I'm told. Um, yeah, none of this makes me happy at all. But it also, I mean, the color spread is exactly even. We got equipment, white, black, blue, uh, green, red land it's like it's we're gonna take the shitty land oh we did it we did it we're taking it yeah throttles keep coming around too that really makes me freaking happy uh the, i hear this card sucks uh i don't want to give my guys i mean why am i taking blue cards you ask uh zombies and spirits it might might come down to that we're gonna take the macabre Ooh, this is tough let's see uh we don't need madness outlets but we might want to throw land in our yard uh, or throw a card in the yard to get delirium because delirium is going to be pretty sweet in our deck uh but 
we might want to get dudes back because we're going to be spilling cards. So we're going to do that. Clip wings will go in the board. I mean, we are considering it. <laughs> Skadecophobia. Everyone's scared of it now, Marshall. It's your fault. Your fault. I'm going to take it just for funsies. Oh, look, a useless card. Uh, oh, it is self mill. You know what? Let's not, let's not, let's not say it's useless. Let's, let's, not, let's look at it really quick. Put the top X cards in your library, uh, from your library to your graveyard, and they lose two life for each creature. Oh, look at that, guys. White, black, removal. Let's see, maybe this vessel will come back around and we'll make our dreams of playing green viable. Uh, I mean, I didn't see any fork in the roads at all. I don't think I saw a one. So this isn't even a question. We're going to take that. Uh, I think black, like, I feel like black white is the safest. Um, oh, I like both these. Uh, watching the wind. Yeah, let's bolster our white a bit. Although the drifter is two drop, though. But. Ooh. We've got so many one drops. I mean, two drops aren't necessarily that important, but this thing could get flying. But this is a two for one. Notice I use all the lingo because I listen to the podcasts and the read the articles and I'm trying to get good. Still suck. I mean, I'm sure people are watching this going, what the hell is Homeboy doing? All right. Uh, none of this really furthers our plans to self mill and delirium. Man, red must be open. There we go. This makes zombies happen. Uh, each zombie in the yard, so useless. And then I get more zombies when I cast zombie spells. So that doesn't even count towards any of that shit. But this does stuff when we mill it which is nice shamble back does as well we don't i don't think we have sorceries at all but do we really want to waste on that oh god we're gonna go with this thing that's so sad i'm really kind of sad about it i mean i'm not willing to pivot into blue oh guys guys i don't have the mana fixing to support this, but I want this card. Ongoing investigations. Uh, the only one I like more than this is uh, what is it? Uvenwald Mysteries. I love that card. I've got okay, Sanitarium Skeleton. Feeling you. Feel it. Uh, once again, great for killing to the Necropod, which we have one of. Um, I have played a limited match uh, in real life where somebody played two necropods and uh there was nothing i could do but get beat down so sad days uh devil thorn fox i don't think it's gonna do me any good uh, i need to be a little beefier in the back end with this which probably means i should have gone blue but you know what i'm really happy with the white we have uh it's a little all over the place like theme wise like, we didn't stick to zombies. We didn't really stick to spirits. Um, I mean, how how good can our green splash be that we might want the scavenger? I mean, if we're, if we're able to hit delirium well. But then again, this thing with the cavalry, I mean, we're going to have to go. I mean, that's how much life? Six life? No, for life. Woo, it's pretty piss poor, guys. I'm not. I'm not exactly happy with these pulls. Uh, we're not gonna pivot into blue. We're going going to take that guy. I know it looks like I didn't make that decision. because uh, I didn't. Murderer's axe. I mean, we're really committing to a lot of. I mean, I th if we have the true face sensor, we have the neglected heirloom. We have one flipping card. Uh, so really, we're keeping this card here for the chance that it might get onto our Abyssinian miss missionary. That's kind of a crap plan, guys. It's not good. 
Let's pivot into blue. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Jokes. This is a sorcery card. I like this card. Ongoing investigations. Is that the second one or did it come back? Huh. Well, I feel like we didn't do a terrible job. I mean, there's, there's creatures, there's spells we're going to have to sort it through later. I'm going to take this just for funsies. But mana fixing is a problem. This is perfect. I don't know why I didn't take that the first time. Uh, now that the pack's gone all the way around, blue, uh, I don't think uh, red-green werewolves is a thing at our table at all. Uh, green humans, not a thing. This provisioner's gone around a couple times. I'm going to take him just for funsies. Uh, we're going to see if that green splash is going to happen because it's not looking good. Um, Shizzy. Open the armory. To guarantee. Now, that's a terrible plan. We'll sideboard it. Necropod times dose. Whenever you deal. Whew. That's a, cra that's a crazy splash. Why would I do that? Why would I do it, guys? Investigate. Investigations. Crap. Let's take the Necropod. The Waltz. Eh, let's put it in there. Any thoughts? Put it in there. All right. Gross. Okay. Well, I think we did okay, though. We're going for some delirium. But our self, self mill is kind of weak. It's kind of weak. I mean, thinking I'm going to keep the only deck that's going to keep Liliana's indignations, indignations in there. It's going to be me. Uh, shizzle. Okay. I think we're going to go for the tiniest of little green splashies. Which will be, oof, that's tough. But it's all for the sake of the mill. Uh, let's, let's cancel this for now. Let's put this to the side. We want that foul orchard in there, though, so. Okay, so we're looking to get down to 24 cards. Uh, this might not make the cut. Neither is that. True Faith Sensor can come out. We did not, 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 not commit to. Oof. See, do you play Abyssinian Missionaries on the chance that you, you nail it? I mean, Neglected Heirloom is the one thing that's the gamble. The True Faith Sensor, that's good. That's just, that's pretty decent. It'll do work. You know, you throw it on any old thing. Uh, we've got Toppelgeist, Dead Weight, Sanitarium Skeleton, Shambleback may not have a place. Let's sort these by color. Uh, sorceries, Ghoul Collar Accomplices is helpful if we're going to be self milling. I wish I would have gotten some Dauntless Cathars. This guy might just not do it because it's a two, two for three. And I have one, two. That doesn't count as a zombie spell. What the frick counts as a zombie spell? Because it doesn't say zombie creature. It's a zombie spell. Is there a distinction I'm missing? I mean... Now, here's a question. I feel like I stuck with black, even though it was my first pick, and I did okay. I mean, I got a tooth collector, got a dead weight, sinister concoction. I feel like I did okay. I mean, what am I missing? Like an air of falcon wrath? Oh, see, this is embarrassing. How much time am I going to take? Okay, our white, not very much white, except for our big bomby guy at the end here. We're going to try to stay alive. Uh, do we have any spirits kicking? No. Do we have any reason at all 
to switch. I got this guy because if we're going to go Delirium, that might be... I mean, it's not my m most favorite win condition ever is to try try to manic scribe someone it's so it takes so long it's been done but it takes a long time uh let's see let's throw two of these cards away maybe a third and then get this thing going because you know i'm wasting all your times you like my cop waltz if we're going to commit to the self mill uh Hounds of Farba, Necropod, Nick, Nick, Nick. What do you guys think? I'm thinking. Hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's a lot of one drops. I don't want to take a creature out. I want to keep creatures in because, you know, the indignation does do more, even though it's a crap card, if I have creatures chilling. Uh, this deck is insanity. I don't say that in, like, the positive fashion. I say it's made by a crazy person. Uh, I have no idea what to do here. Okay. Okay. Let's just get it done with. In a land, we're at 26 cards. Let's take three cards out. I'm... No, Missionaries is too possibly good. That's a removal. That's good. That's good. That's fine. But getting stuck with two of those in your hand is not is not great. There are 25 cards. Let's go down to 24. We play 16 or 17 more take the waltz out I'm not feeling it tunnel gloom once again we will pay so much black to mill ourselves although our mana fixing sucks like honestly we couldn't have gotten one fork in the road it sucks but we were we we're gonna splash that green real low and then we hopefully won't pay for it with a card in our hand okay Come on, Tyler, this video's going on too long. Hmm. Let's stick with it. Let's do it. 16 lands. So, I'm going to check this down to two. What's our... Hmm. Feeling pretty even here is fine. That's 15 lands. Do we just... Oh, no, 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 that's fine. We've got that Foul Orchard. Well, I, st I feel like that's not enough. Here we go. Add to deck. Take a card out, silly. Uh, I'm going to play the Indignations. Everyone's probably screaming, like, don't play that piece of crap card. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. Mill myself out. Epitaph Golem. Inspector. That puts... Mm, meh, meh. All right. Take a swamp out. Submit your deck. All right. Well, let's see how it goes. Ooh.